This new Yone build is extremely OP if built in the correct situations, and I'll show you why. Blade of the Ruined King is the unique aspect of the build, and we'll compare the damage of Blade versus Shield Bow against a squishy target using a quick trade. So what I was able to find is that Blade of the Ruin King wins out by around 100 damage, dealing 602 damage with that combo, as opposed to Shield Bow only dealing 503 damage. Now if we take a look at an extended trade where you throw in a couple more auto attacks, Blade of the Ruin King still wins out, dealing 971 damage, as opposed to Shield Bow at 831. So what we can take away from this one item comparison is that Blade of the Ruin King is going to be the better early game snowball -y option. Now once you reach the mid game and hit your two item spike, this is where things start to get a little bit interesting, so we'll be comparing Blade and Shield Bow against Shield Bow and IE. So with our quick trade combo, Blade and Shield Bow is dealing 715 damage, as opposed to Shield Bow and Infinity Edge at 841 damage, so Shield Bow and Infinity Edge actually wins out here. And then as for our extended trade experiment, Blade and Shield Bow is dealing 1,253 damage, and Shield Bow and IE is dealing 1,479, so against a squishy target in the mid game on two items, crit is going to be the higher damage setup than the Blade of the Ruined King. Now the final damage comparison is going to be on two items, but this time against a tank. So far all the experiments we've done have been against a squishy, but how do the items or how do the builds uh, match up against each other when playing against more tanks? So if you're taking an extended trade with Blade of the Ruin King and Shield Bow, you're going to be dealing 1051 damage against a tank. Shield Bow and Infinity Edge is only dealing 924 damage. So what we were able to take away from these damage tests is that no build is the best in all situations. Blade the Ruin King is best in the early game on one item. It's going to provide you with more snowball power against tanks. Blade the Ruin King is also going to be stronger. But if you're going up against a lot of squishy champions and say you're not like snowballing super hard in the early game, you're going even in lane and you're going to be playing more so to scale, that's where crit is going to come in and be a little bit stronger. So hopefully this video has given you a better understanding of when you should be prioritizing which build on your Yone. If you enjoyed the video, then be sure to drop a like and subscribe if you have yet to already. So thanks for watching, have an awesome day, and I'll see you in my next video.